Welcome to the opening fixture of this season's UEFA Europa League. Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. My name's Peter Drury and here's my co-commentator for the game, it's Jim Begley. Well, thanks, Peter. There's a great sense of anticipation in this stadium. And I've been hit by it, too. There is the anthem, the familiar precursor to this intriguing contest. So, this is how the two teams line up. So it's away we go then. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? I'm going to go for William. Um, Brazilian flair and European discipline. He probably should score a few more, but he delivers what it says on the box. He's bright and imaginative going forward and committed to getting back. Yeah, hard to see past him. He'll be looking to put on a show, I'm certain of that. Going through. And he just whacks it away. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. And that's sprayed out wide. Over to the left, and the weighted pass. And the ball's come out! Cesc Fabregas, Jorginho, passes it through, William looking to get on the end of this, he's got away, Gunter knocks it away, it's been a rather gentle affair so far, that's Pilaqueta, Hazard, looks like a good ball through, Back to the keeper and go again. Sommer sends that a long way. Cesc Fabregas. Midway through the first half and there's an impotence about this game that's causing me concern and, and probably most of the stadium too. Let's just hope that by the end it'll have been forgotten. Tries a through ball. That will be a throw in. The ball's come loose and the chase is on. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. It's being played forward. He's awarded a free kick. <laughs> Plenty of 
played it short. Hit into the middle. Azar. Aimed long and direct. Now, what's he got in mind? It's Aspilicueta. Played in by Aspilicueta. Up to meet it! And he's done it! First blood drawn! Just so calm under pressure. Demonstrated great strength there. I mean, he really had to hold his man off and just create enough room for him to be able to get the shot away. And I think it's just top, top play. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Chance to break. It's a promising run he's making on the right. He's left his man. Now it's Azar. Pulls loose, who's getting there? Peter, we can only applaud that quality of tackle in the circumstances. It was probably goal-saving. Chip through. Time to deliver. Looks to slip it through. Swept in. And he's there to cut it out. Now the pass. Chills one in. And it's been taken short. William displaying his defensive capabilities there. That's no striker's tackle. I think it's great to see that kind of application and desire from a forward who wants to help out his defence. I, I think, you know, any good team, really, your striker should be the first line in that defence, and, and he's delivering. And there's the end of the first half. And there we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal. It is very, very tight. Well, this team has found a real rhythm to their game. The players seem to have clicked well, there's good movement off the ball, the passes are sticking. No one's afraid to have a go. Chelsea leading 1-0 at the break. They've dropped me into the second 45 minutes. Chelsea going well here, and they're in a good position to kick on and add to their lead. They don't have to overcommit, but they can place more emphasis on stretching their advantage without necessarily neglecting things defensively. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. That's gone a long way up and away. Well, that's the first attempt, Peter, we've seen at one of those raking passes just to spread the play. Coach through there. Could be thinking about a shot here. Referee has seen that as a dive. Listen, he can play the innocent as much as he wants, Peter, but it was fairly obvious to everyone here. He's got no hiding place. Now it's Azar. Looks like a good ball through. Conte. Now it's Azar. Whipped in. And that's been levered clear. As Piquetta plays it back in. Zappa Costa crosses it once more. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, there's room for trouble. Uh, I just think they're sending out the wrong message. This could backfire. Oh, he's got a crucial block in there. Corner it is. There is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Yes. 
Fabregas goes That's looking. what has to be done now, no question about it. Oh, this isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it, this is what they have to do. Giroud tries a through ball. Tries to get it forward quickly. Mönchengladbach have just about everyone back and central. Yeah, clearly. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Chelsea presented with the perfect chance here to open up their lead. William ready to try one. William against the crossbar. Has a hit. And that wasn't far away. As Piliqueta probably tried a bit too hard then. He should have relied on technique as opposed to power. it out to the wing referee's given a throw it's deflected over the goal line for a corner Rudiger boots it to safety Now it's Durvic. Munch and Gladbach are definitely not going down without a scrap. Their attitude just can't be faulted. Going through. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. Munch and Gladbach, their final change. I think you have to admire his willingness to keep plugging away, but the manager has, has done him a big favour, I think, by, by taking him off. You know, he was looking very, very leggy. And he just whacks it away. Chelsea are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. Just brushed off the ball there. Now the counter, and it's Jorginho. Jorginho passes it through, and the shot! He scored! Two up now, and they are cruising. Uh, given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. It's rarely a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. Two up and very little time left. Surely this is it. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Turmic. Josip Turmic. Looks to slip it through. Fires it in low. Confirmation that there will be two minutes stoppage time. Now it's Giroud. Giroud with the ball through. He's got options out wide. William keeps everyone guessing. It's a loose ball. The final whistle. Chelsea start as they wanted to start. All three points, the first three points, crucially. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Well, pressure can quickly build on you if a positive result isn't achieved in your opening group match. Instead, they can take.